This is gonna be another quick what I eat in a day video as a whole food plant-based vegan. So, Mr. Coconut, we're gonna make another video. Yeah? He's always in such a good mood. Well, pretty much always, not all the time. <laughs> he doesn't like his brother very much, my other bird. So they just, they don't get along very well at all. And this bird, Mr. Cuckoo Nut, he's definitely the boss. Yeah. Yeah? Mm. Let's go make breakfast. Do you want to make breakfast? Yeah. Peach <laughs> boo. Mm. They smell so good. I love the way birds smell. <laughs> This one's a really good one. It's it's like butter. Mm, these are really good. I'm gonna eat two of these suckers. And this is the honey kiss melon, which basically tastes like a cantaloupe. These are healthy, slimming carbs. They'll keep you super energized, tons of fiber. These are definitely not the kind of carbs that'll make you overweight or healthy carbs on like, you know, processed garbage junk food, which has given the carbs a bad name. Cause those kind of carbs will make you overweight, sick and diseased. But these carbs, they're good carbs. There's a huge difference between bad carbs and good carbs. So the good carbs you want to smash in, they're very, very good. And the great thing about being whole foods plant-based, it's far less calorically dense than animal products because you know for example if you're eating animal products you have to monitor your portions and calorically restrict yourself because if you don't you're going to end up in trouble when you're eating whole food plant-based you can eat it in abundance it's such a joy because you don't have to restrict your calories or restrict your portions i i literally lost over 30 pounds being low fat whole food plant-based and I'm not afraid of fat whatsoever, but you know, I'm not gonna eat bucketfuls of nuts and seeds because they're very high fat. And the fat you eat is the fat you wear. And actually leaves links down below. So, and also when you're eating greens like kale and spinach, you wanna eat it with fat because the fat helps you absorb the nutrients from the greens. So I always eat healthy fats every single day, such as either avocado, and of course I eat flax seeds, chia seeds, or hemp seeds every day to get my uh, omega-3 in. So it's not like I don't eat fat, I just don't eat high fat. So when you're eating low fat, high carb, whole food plant-based, it's such a joy to eat. I, eat. I eat fruit, nuts and seeds, potatoes, rice, beans, corn, oats, all the healthy foods and it's, it's, it's awesome. If you haven't tried it, I highly recommend. And the first thing I noticed when I went whole food plant-based was the energy it gives you. Oh my gosh, the energy is like, I have so much energy. I'm like up, I never ever used to be a morning person and now I'm a morning person. Like it's crazy, I don't even use an alarm clock. So that's awesome. I no longer ever, ever get constipated. You know, there are so many children in the U.S. who are constipated, little children. And I remember too, when I was a little kid, I had the worst constipation. And it's just, uh, you know, there's no fiber in animal products. powder in this, Indian gooseberry powder in this to give it an extra antioxidant boost. And I also have my omega-3 in here because I put a lot of chia seeds in it. So blueberries, raspberries, apples. Also I had some cranberries in this. It's so, so, so good.
really, really good. I almost forgot to show you, now I'm snacking on my homemade healthy oatmeal cookies. And you guys are probably so sick of seeing me eat these all the time. I just can't help it, they're just so good. So I'm just snacking on this cookie, I almost forgot to record it. myself at the moment because the day is almost over and I actually made myself a potent green smoothie and normally if I don't make this in the morning it just it just doesn't get done I don't want to drink this but I'm gonna force it down anyway because it's super healthy there's arugula kale spinach celery wheatgrass uh, ginger lemon juice I put parsley in it yeah, so cheers. Yo it by yacht. I could never in a million years drink this without plugging my nose. There is no way I could drink this. All done. Good enough. Better than nothing. So glad that's over with. Whew. You know, it's potent. I mean, it's really not that bad. It just grosses me out. I don't know why, <laughs> but it's really, really good for you. And health as well. That's all that matters. <laughs> it looks bland, but it's nice. It's delicious. It's the baked Japanese sweet potato. I love those sweet potatoes. And then I'm having beets. Beets are amazing. <laughs> and then I'm having the baked beans. I love, love baked beans. And I was gonna have this with avocado, but unfortunately, the avocado I had was bad. So I was also gonna bake my favorite tofu with the sweet chili ginger sauce by the jelly, jelly ginger people, because that's so good. I mean, oh my gosh, it's super delicious. I'm gonna show you what I'm having for dessert. <laughs> I'm gonna go eat this thing before it gets cold. That dinner was so good. I can't even tell you how good it was. It, it was so simple, but it was so good. I'm actually gonna eat that for dinner again tomorrow night. But for dessert, I'm having chai tea with a honey crisp apple. And if you've never tried a honey crisp apple, oh my gosh, they're so good. Honestly, these apples are very different from other apples. They're super crispy. They're they're just very very different from the gala apples and the you know other variations of apples. So if you've never tried a honey crisp apple, I will totally check it out. This is hands down my favorite apple in the entire world. <laughs> it's really really good. Actually, it goes really well with this tea. So to make the chai tea latte, Trader Joe's, <laughs> and got this. That's my dessert. <laughs> mm, it's very hot. That is so good. Bye. Can you say goodbye? <laughs> so anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. It really does help me out a lot and appreciate it. And if you enjoyed the video, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Anyways, hope you guys have a great evening or morning, wherever you are. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Don't remove the Asian lama a long, long time ago. This is the time of the apocalypse. The dream of the last thing